Hey everybody, I'm back. Sorry, I have been MIA. We had a trip planned to go to visit mother-in-law up in Upper State, New York. I probably talked about it briefly at uh, the last time I did a video. So today is Monday, August 21st, and I'm just going over with you what we spent while we were away. Um, so mother-in-law had a heart valve replacement and then a, a medical, little, little medical issue after the fact. And so she's still in rehab. So we were gone from Wednesday of last week and we just got back tonight. So I wanted to show you what we spent while we were gone. I got some happy mail, so I want to go over that. And then of course, if you have not, or if you do not know, the Budget Mom workbooks are out as of today. They went um, they went on, that you can buy them, thebudgetmom.com. And I will say that this method has, um, you know, open my eyes to where we're spending, what we're spending. And even though I come back from a five day hiatus with my family, um, we were still intentional with our money and what we spent. So um, because we had to eat out and buy groceries and stuff, we probably spent a little bit more than uh, normally we would in the five days, but I am eager, like I think most people are, to start again, to start September. I know it's a couple of weeks away, um, but to get really back on track. And I think the fall reminds me of just getting back on track. And, you know, there's not too many things happening where you have to spend money or in my life anyway. So uh, I'm eager just to get back to it. But let me go ahead and show you what we spent. I just put this all together um, a few minutes ago. So for gas, we spent $140. Now it's um, from Southeastern Massachusetts to Niagara Falls, New York. Dine out while we were there for the five days was two hundred five forty eight. I'll tell you, one breakfast for two of us was $26. I just could not believe it. So that was a crazy breakfast. I don't know why. We didn't have anything different. It was just ridiculous. Grocery was $198.55. And then dog sitting for five days was $50 a day. And that was $300. You know what I'm missing here is... Um, I had $200 cash, um, but what I actually took up was 170 so I'm just going to put cash here, and that obviously is gone as well, let's be honest, because I did have 200 but then I paid the babysitter 30 so all together, and this includes the dog set, obviously, that's not right, I typed it too fast. It's 10 14 03. So really, you know, just over a thousand dollars, you know, and that that really isn't that bad to be honest. I mean, like I said, because my mother in law was in the hospital that, that the whole time we were there, you know, we had to do groceries, we got her stuff, and you know, I didn't mind spending that money for her because God knows she's helped us in the past. So, you know what? Tomorrow's a new day, so I'll be getting paid on Wednesday and be able to um, use that check toward things coming up this week as well as then you know start creating the september budget which i hope to do within the next week to be honest with you because i am eager to get it going all right so that i did order some happy meal while we were away and this is my erin condren load um i got stuff from the um 60 percent off and I think I only got a few things. So here are the coil clip connectors. I kind of always wanted to use these, so I'm kind of excited that it comes 12. I don't know how I'm going to use them yet, but maybe you can give me some ideas if you use them yourself. But it's almost like a picture in there. Kind of cool. So it says, like, stick it, snap it, save it. You know, I don't know. Let's see. Be creative. And then I did get this beautiful 7x9. I love that cover. Isn't that pretty? And this starts in January. So I just put my name Patty on it. Nothing special. No budgets or anything. I think I'm just going to... I love it. Oh my God. It's so pretty. The colors are just phenomenal. I always like their planes anyways. They're just so pretty. I mean, they're so pretty. You know, it's just... It, it, this is a 7x9. It's just a monthly planner. You know, have enough courage to start. Um, today I choose Joy and it starts with January. So how I'm going to use this one, I believe, is I'm going to use the calendar 
for our spending calendar. So kind of just how I use the other seven by nine um, Erin Condren that just showed you. So the calendar is going to be for spending and then maybe I'll just keep all my um, other things in here. Like instead of having three or four notebooks, I'll have, I mean, I still will, unfortunately, oh, or fortunately, because I really like that, but I'll also have room to keep track of my credit card, debt payments, etc. So this doesn't start till January, but I'm really happy I bought it because it was a really good deal and I couldn't pass it up for getting a monthly planner. So, and I really like the cover. It's really, really pretty. And then I also got some $10 notebooks because, you know, hey. And these are at Create, Motivate, Inspire. And I am actually going to take these to work. I got one for myself and one for my boss because, you know, I just like it. I'm going to keep the purple one and give her the turquoise. But, you know, it's like top priorities. And we've been kind of doing meetings about top priorities and etc. So I'm kind of eager to get excited, started with that. So as soon as I get my budget mom by paycheck workbook, I will also um, go over that with you. So I, if I, I'm hoping that if I get the budget by paycheck workbook in by September, I'm going to start using that in September. Um, and so I'll have the budget by paycheck workbook for my paycheck. I'll have the um, humble beginnings that I'm using, which is Sarah Marie's stickers her book as well for the joint and fixed account and then in january i'll just go to the erin condren this just to do um, like i'm kind of doing already in this one which is just to do the calendar for spending so that is my story um thanks for coming and watching my my channel and if you haven't seen the, um, I think these are sold out, unfortunately, but if you haven't seen the uh, Erin Condren 60% off sale, you know, go and check it out. Um, there's a lot of cool stuff there. I don't know if I have a code, but maybe if I do, I'll leave it below for you. And again, thanks for being here. And I will see you in a couple of days to go over my next paycheck with you. Thanks everybody for watching. Bye.